Are you looking to add machine vision to your project? On this episode of Tech Ventures with Lozina, learn how to add a camera module to your embedded system design or proof of concept using the adapter board created by the Future Electronic System Design Center. Hi, welcome back to Tech Ventures. My name is Lozina and I'm the technical marketing engineer at Future Electronics. If you're interested in checking out any previous Tech Ventures videos, then please click the link on the screen or check out the description box below. Image sensors are adding amazing capabilities to autonomous systems, allowing them to detect changes in the environment and the possibility to act without human intervention. The challenge with image sensor prototyping is that too often the sensors itself aren't compatible with the embedded processor evaluation boards. This usually means that the design engineer needs to create a specialized adapter board just to be able to test their concept. Often, this is not taken into consideration and causes delays in development time. The Future Electronic System Design Center created an easy evaluation platform, the Cyclops Converter Board, to help speed prototyping for image processing applications such as barcode scanning, machine vision, gesture recognition, and biometrics. The Cyclops Converter Board bridges the OnSemi CMOS image sensor module to the Cairo QS8M processor module or the NXP i.mx Ada Mini Evaluation Board to form the Cyclops system. And today I'm going to walk you through the Cyclops system. First up, we have the FoxLink camera module. It has 1.0 megapixel resolution and is based on the OnSemi CMOS image sensor. On its own, the camera module kind of looks like one eye, hence the name Cyclops. With a compact size, wide field of view, and global shutter capability, this OnSemi-based IAS module is great for imaging applications including machine vision and robotics requiring fast image capture capability. Part of the IAS module family from OnSemi developed for customer prototyping needs, the module includes standardized connectors and layout configuration. I'm going to attach the camera module to the converter board using the two-row vertical connector like so. The MIPI switch passes on the data collected through a mini SAS connector. For the purposes of today's demonstration, I will be using the NXP i.mx Adam Mini Evaluation Board. I'm going to connect the Cyclops board using the mini SAS connector, like so. The i.mx Aiden Mini Board provides a platform for comprehensive evaluation of the i.mx Aiden Mini and i.mx Aiden Mini Lite application processors. It delivers high performance with power efficiency, multimedia interfaces, and Wi-Fi Bluetooth for connectivity out of box. I have powered on my board and I will turn on the switch. I see that the LED over here is a solid green, so everything is powered as it should be. I have already flashed the example binary code to the board. There are two ways to view what the camera module is capturing. We can directly connect the NXP board to a display monitor using an HDMI cable or have the Wi-Fi Bluetooth module transmit the video feed to a wireless video player such as VLC or GStreamer. I am going to stream the content on GStreamer. So the next step is to open a terminal emulator program and I'm going to use TerraTerm today. Make sure you select the appropriate COM port. There will be two when you plug in your board and select the higher of the two. I'm going to set the serial port like so. I am going to enter a few commands in TerraTerm. I just want to mention that I've already configured the Wi-Fi module on the NXP i.mx Aiden mini board to transmit the stream wirelessly. I have already copied the stream batch file into the bin folder for GStreamer, and I'm going to run the batch file by double-clicking the file like so. A video player dialog box will open automatically. And there we have it, a live video feed. The Cyclops board simplifies development time needed to design with a camera module and embedded processors. It really facilitated the flow of communication over here. Now that you're connected, 
you can begin your own designs to explore the power of the NXP i.MX Aiden Mini processor family for applications ranging from basic camera storage to full object detection and even facial recognition. On Semi's CMOS image sensor module produces extraordinarily clear, sharp digital pictures, and its ability to capture both continuous video and single frames makes it the perfect choice for a wide range of applications, including scanning and industrial inspection. To request a demo or for more information on the Cyclops converter board on Semi or NXP, please contact your local Future Electronics representative or visit us at futureelectronics.com. Thanks for watching, and I'll catch you next time on Tech Ventures with Lazina.